Hey guys, how's it going? Jason's here. In today's video, I will show you how to configure BLF key on Yealink IP phone with Yeastar S Series PBX. Well, actually, the feature we're going to set is to monitor extension status and pick up a call to that extension right on an IP phone. At the very beginning, let's spare some time to figure out the BLF feature. Busy lamp field, which is a light on an IP phone that tells you whether another extension or trunk connected to the same PBX is busy or not. The light will usually display in three different ways. If it's static green, it makes the monitor the extension or trunk is idle. If it's static red, it makes the extension is on a call or trunk is in use, whether the call is connected. If it's blinking in red, it makes the extension is raining. The real status displayed might vary depending on the type of your IP phone. Now, let's see how to configure the feature on Yealink IP phone. Before we get started, it's important to note that this feature requires the support of both IP phone and IP PBX. And the IP phones should be connected to the same PBX. In this video, we will take Yealink T46S as an example. T46S and another IP phone have been connected to the same S300. Line 1 of both IP phones has been registered to extension 500 and 501 respectively. We're going to set a BLF key on T46S to monitor the status of 501 and pick up its calls. Now, log in to the web GUI of T46S, find the DSS key, choose the line key, say line key 1, set the type to BLF, enter the monitor the extension number 501 in value. As for label, enter 501, so the extension number will be displayed on the screen of the phone. Next, choose line 1, which has been registered to the extension 500. And the last step, enter the default feature code asterisk 04. Save and apply the settings. Now, as we can see, the light of line 1 is static green, which makes the extension 501 is idle. It's blinking in red, that shows there is an incoming call to 501. Once the user answers the call, you can see the line becomes static red. If we try to answer the incoming call, press the button. We're getting connected to the caller. Alright, hope you guys like this video. And there's a subscribe button. Smash it. Don't forget to check our document center as well. I will see you guys in the next one.